by Preetha Sarkar London, Reuters, a lack of discipline has led Bernard Tomic and Nick Kyrgios to hit the self-destruct button and their behaviour is tarnishing the image of Australian tennis, Ken Rosewill told Reuters. The 20-something tearaways have long been tipped for Grand Slam glory but, after several years on the tour, the sum total of their achievements is three-quarter finals at the majors. Along the way, they have also paid lots of fines for their bad behavior. Last week, Tomic was fined $15,000 by the sports governing body, the International Tennis Federation, ITF, after saying he was bored and had faked injury during a listless first-round defeat at Wimbledon. His comments led to him being dropped by his racket sponsor head. Kyrgios, similarly, has said he struggles to stay motivated and was fined $16,500 by the ATP, which runs the men's tour, last October for purposely throwing a game away during his second-round defeat by Misha Zverev at the Shanghai Masters. Such lack of respect for the sport does not sit well with 82-year-old Rosewell, who did not earn a penny in prize money when he won his first four Grand Slam titles during the 1950s when the majors were only open to amateur players. I feel a lot of us older players, who came from tennis playing families, we learned to play the game and behave. Rosewell, who is in London too, Celebrate the 50th anniversary of the 1967 Wimbledon Pro event, told Reuters in an interview. Plus, the fact there was more discipline then. When I first came overseas, Harry Hopman was the captain and coach of the team. Our team was made up of players of 17, 18 and 19 years of age and he was like a father figure.